Greetings everyone, this is Associate Pastor Matt with Burlington Baptist Church. And in this video, I'm going to be sharing some announcements for the week of Sunday, August 16th, 2020. Now, of course, we haven't been doing our normal announcements ever since uh, the pandemic when we started uh, meeting outside. Uh, the services we wanted to keep shorter because of weather concerns. And so I thought now that things are cranking up more and there are more announcements, and I know that convolutes your emails, and I'm sorry, uh, I thought that the videos would be helpful for kind of consolidating all that information. So you can expect to see these pop up every week or two um, so you can watch them and just know everything that's going on with Burlington Baptist Church. So without further ado, here's this week's announcement video. Uh, first of all, we have prayer groups. The ladies group is meeting Sunday evenings at 7 o'clock p.m. Uh, currently, they're, that's the time they're meeting, and they're meeting at the outdoor pavilion, same place where we do our services. Uh, they've been using small group questions to go through uh, Hebrews as we're preaching through it on Sunday mornings and, uh, of course, praying together as well. So if you have any questions about that, please contact uh, Pam. Now, the men, we are also hoping to get started back with our prayer groups, uh, our prayer group, rather. Um, we were using Zoom the, pretty much since the pandemic started, and we're going to continue using Zoom for now. Uh, and, of course, plans could change eventually, uh, but we're going to stick with that for now. And if you're interested in joining that, we want to know what day and what time is best for you. I know Sunday evenings were not exactly the easiest time for everyone, uh, so... And everyone's, I know it, it's kind of a, schedules are changing uh, more frequently during this time. So uh, if you could go in the uh, description below and just go fill out the link to that, that would be helpful. Also, if you are the parent of a youth, uh, youth group we are hoping to start back uh, in the month of September. And uh, we want to know how to best serve your needs as we look towards that. So if you could please go fill out that survey, that would be greatly appreciated. Uh, we, as we are moving indoors in October, have some cleaning needs. Obviously, the church building has remained somewhat dormant uh, since March. And so uh, we do have various needs for cleaning projects. And so if you would like to help out with that, if you could please contact uh, the head of trustees, Renee, or you're welcome to just contact me, uh, email, text, or phone, whatever, and we'd be happy to get you set up and helping with that. And if you have any ideas for projects, uh, please contact us, and uh, that would be very helpful. So, uh, a few service projects coming up. Uh, we served, a, we started a partnership with Edward Stone Middle School last year, and so, uh, of course, with the pandemic going on, uh, they're going to have more needs than normal this school year. And so, uh, first of all, we want to help by donating some supplies to them. So, we're going to have a list in the description below of the supplies that they need, and if you. Uh, Feel free to purchase some of those things. Bring them on Sunday mornings. We're going to have a, the table where we put our offering box every Sunday by the garage. We'll also have a box there where you can put uh, school supplies in. So, Also in another service project for Edward Stone. Uh, they're going to be doing a sewing mask. Uh, the ladies are going to get together to do that on Saturday, August 22nd at 9 a.m. And they're going to be meeting also at that outdoor pavilion. There's uh, at least, I think, eight or so electrical outlets there. So there's plenty of uh, devices to plug into for sewing machines and all that good stuff. So if you want to be involved with that, if you can get in contact with Lisa or Pam, uh, and they'd be happy to give you any other additional details that you uh, may want to know. We have a baptism celebration coming up soon, which I'm so excited about. There is... Nothing greater than celebrating the second birth and celebrating our conversion, right? Uh, it is uh, the biggest, perhaps life-changing moment of our lives, uh, apart from, I guess, when we were born. So um, we're going to be celebrating one at Big Hollow Lake. We did a baptism here last year as well, for those of you that were there. Uh, we went to the beach there. We're going to go to that same location. So if you check the description, we'll have a link to uh, the map so that you can know specifically where we're talking about. It's pinned on there. But it's going to be on Saturday, August 22nd at 4 o'clock p.m. So a week from this Saturday, and uh, we're really excited about that. If you are wanting to be baptized, you've never been baptized uh, as a professing believer before, then please get in contact with Pastor Kendall or myself, 
and we'd be happy to talk to you about that. If you could do that ASAP, uh, that would be fantastic. So please mark that on your calendars. Also, to mark on your calendars, September 20th, it's a Sunday, 6 o'clock p.m. that day is going to be our next business meeting. And so that will be an important one as we uh, work through more so the details of how we will transition going back indoors as we approach the winter months ahead. So September 20th at 6 o'clock p.m. And then the last announcement for today, uh, the Walk to End Alzheimer's. That is on uh, October 10th. Now, normally there's like a walk everyone does together, but because of the pandemic, they're just going to be kind of letting people do things at their own will, their own discretion, wherever they want. But if you want to sign up for that, if you want to participate in fundraising and all that good stuff, uh, then we'll have a link in the description below that you can click if you want to be a part of that. So, well, that's all the announcements for this week, church family. Thanks so much for watching. We love you. Talk to you soon.